Go ahead. Hello, Evelyn. It is remarkable what you've done with the place, Doctor. Where were you last year when we were building the set for Brigadoon? I could have used you. Why don't you sit down, Evelyn? I, I'm fine, thanks. Is this your son? Oh. Why didn't he audition for the play? Ephraim saves his theatrical side for our arguments. Ah, too bad, such a handsome face he takes after his father. As does your beautific daughter. Both of your auditions were top notch. Evelyn. I got the lab results on some of the blood work we did. I'm very sorry to- I think you will be happy with the role I've selected for you, if it fits your stage presence. Evelyn, I'm trying to tell you that- That I have leukemia, doctor? Uh, you knew. So it's confirmed, then. Uh, it's not an impressive guess. It's, guess it's a dragon I've battled before. I, I didn't know. No one. And Everwood does. Not in Everwood, at least. Twelve years ago, I was living in New York. I... My career was just taking off. I'd been cast in the lead opposite Billy Crudup in Lincoln Center, and I was diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia. I never went up in the play. Instead, I... The disease took its toll. I moved here to live with my brother and finish out my days in peace. <laughs> and then it happened. I am still not sure how, but little by little, I began to get well again. Before I knew it, I was in full remission. That's when my brother suggested I join the living and direct the winter musical. <laughs> so you see, doctor, I came to Everwood to die, and I ended up living out the best years of my life. We need to get you to an oncologist right away. We'll perform a bone marrow aspiration, confirm that it's still myeloid, start you on chemo. In the meantime, I'll check with my friends at the Mayo Clinic. There's a trial that I does, want... Uh, does Edna know? No. I, I haven't told her. I figured you'd want to. You must not tell anyone. Promise me. Of course not. Well, I should really go and make a few calls. He will be at rehearsal tomorrow, right, Doctor? You bet. You are going to be great. <laughs>